In this video, we're going to look at how the denominator changes the size of the pieces in a given shape. We're going to look at two fractions. We're going to look at the fraction 2 fourths and the fraction 3 eighths. And what we're going to do is we're going to focus on the denominator, the 4 and the 8. Now remember, the denominator is the number of equal pieces that we split a shape into. So 2 fourths would be split into four equal pieces. Three eighths would be split into eight equal pieces. Now what I want us to pay attention to here is the size of one piece. One piece in this shape over here takes up one fourth of the shape and one piece over here takes up one eighth of the shape. And what I want to point out is that the larger the denominator as we can all agree, 8 is larger than 4. The larger the denominator, the smaller the pieces will be. So, if we have 1 half, and we draw a circle, 1 half would actually be the largest piece because 1 half is broken into only two pieces. Now, if I were to actually represent these fractions, obviously, I'd have to shade in the appropriate amount, 2 fourths, and then 3 eighths, but the important thing is that the larger the denominator, the smaller the pieces will be, because what you're doing is you're taking the same shape and you're breaking it into more pieces. So think about that. If you have a piece of, or if you have a whole pizza and you break it into more pieces, those pieces have to be smaller.